Hello everyone, my name is Gandolin, and welcome to another World of Warcraft guide. Today we have another video in my series on Hidden Artifact Appearances. Obtaining any of these appearances will award you with the feat of strength called Hidden Potential. In this video, we'll be looking at the Hidden Appearances for Druids. Note that you can obtain any of these appearances regardless of your current spec. First up is Balance. This appearance is called Sunkeeper's Reach, and is unlocked via the Sun Bloom. This gives the Scythe of Elune a fiery appearance. This item is obtained by combining two other items. The first is the Seed of Solar Fire. It can be bought from the Dreamweaver's Quartermaster, Sylvia Hartshorn, in Valshara. You must be exalted with the Dreamweavers in order to purchase it, and it will cost 1600 gold. The second item is the Pure Drop of Shaladrasil's Sap, which drops from Archdruid Gladalis in Darkheart Thicket on any difficulty. In order for it to drop, you must be exalted with the Dreamweavers, and have at least Artifact Knowledge level 5. It is not a guaranteed drop, so it may take multiple runs to get. The best way to reach Exalted with the Dreamweavers is to start by doing all the story quests in Valshara. This will get you to about Honored. From there, do World Quests and Dreamweaver's Emissary Quests in the zone to reach Exalted. Now let's look at Feral. This appearance is called Moon Spirit and is unlocked via the Feather of the Moon Spirit. It turns your cat form into an Owl Cat. This is the most elaborate appearance for druids to obtain. The first thing you need to do is reach Artifact Knowledge level 4. From then on, when you walk through the Emerald Dreamway, there is a daily chance that you will hear a screech coming from one of three portals. The Hinterlands, Duskwood, or Feralus. If the daily roll is successful, you will see an emote in chat that indicates which portal it's coming from. For example, if the screech comes from Duskwood, the emote would read, you hear a strange feral screech coming from the Duskwood portal. Once you see one of the emotes, go through the indicated portal. Once there, you'll have to search the area around the portal for an Owlcat stone. They are typically found near the base of trees. Once you find one and click it, you will receive the Mark of the Moon Spirit buff, and see another emote that says, you hear something dart away behind you, and then just silence. Once you click an Owlcat Stone, you'll have to wait for another day to have a chance to see another emote. You'll never get the same portal twice, so it's just a matter of waiting until you've clicked a stone in each of the three zones. Once you have clicked all three stones, return to the Emerald Dreamway. In the center of the zone, you will see Ella Lothan, the Owlcat Wild God. Shift into cat form and slash sit while targeting him, and the feather will be deposited into your inventory. Next up is the Guardian appearance, which is called Guardian of the Glade. It is unlocked via the Mark of the Glade Guardian, and adorns your bear form with some fearsome bones. The item for this appearance drops from Ursok in the Emerald Nightmare Raid. It drops on all difficulties, but is not guaranteed, so it may take several weeks of running the raid to obtain it. Finally, we have the Restoration Appearance, which is called Warden's Crown. It is unlocked via the Acorn of the Endless, and gives Gahanir a feathery, owl-like appearance. To obtain this item, you must select the Evergreen upgrade to your Order Hall. This allows you to plant seeds in two plots in your Order Hall. The seeds take three days to grow, and when you harvest them, there is a chance that they will drop the acorn. And those are the hidden appearances for the druid artifacts. Remember that you can get any of the hidden appearances regardless of your current spec. And that's it for this video. If this guide helped you, leave a comment down below and give it a big thumbs up. Share this video with your friends and let me know if there's something you need help with. Subscribe to see all of my future videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.